It's a major health breakthrough. Scientists have discovered that nutrients can have a direct effect on gene expression. That means certain health conditions we might be prone to can be affected by what we eat. This emerging science is called nutrigenomics. While nutrigenomics could potentially revolutionize medicine, the challenge is getting people to eat the right foods. That's why the veterinary world is a step ahead. It's easier to control what pets eat. Animals offer us, pets in particular, offer us a very unique possibility to study nutrigenomics because we tend to feed a given food to a pet for a fairly long period of time as opposed to you and I, we eat a whole variety of things and no one's going to tell us exactly what to eat. So we have the opportunity, I think, in the pet area to really get a very uh, rapid advance in our understanding of nutrigenomics as sort of theory and actually looking at what diseases we might be able to prevent or treat. The key to understanding nutrigenomics is understanding gene expression. Genes affect people and pets by producing proteins. Each protein has a different influence on the body. They are associated with increased risk of conditions like obesity or kidney disease. While we can't alter the kinds of proteins genes produce, we can change how much of the protein is produced through targeted nutrition. A gene is fully expressed when it is producing its protein to the maximum extent of its capacity, partially expressed by producing at only part of its capacity, and not expressed if it's not producing any protein. The expression of a gene can change the environmental cues like nutrition. If the gene goes from more expressed to less expressed, the gene is downregulated. If it goes from less expressed to more expressed, we say it's upregulated. By giving our pets the right kinds of food to influence their gene expression, we may be able to keep them healthier longer. There may be specific diseases that an animal is susceptible to getting because of the genes that it has. And if we can feed it the right foods, for example, or perhaps influence other environmental factors besides food, maybe we can prevent some of those diseases. One that I would certainly hope that we might be able to see some prevention strategies for um, might be lower urinary tract disease in cats, just as one example. The science of nutrigenomics is still in its early stages, but its potential impact on the veterinary and human world is astounding. How far can this go? We don't know. But it's, the potential could be um, quite dramatic in terms of changing the aging process or the course of a disease. We might not be able to change um, the actual disease process itself, but we might be able to change the progression of that disease. Hills Pet Nutrition has been instrumental in researching and applying nutrigenomics. With its Active Ingredient Identification Method, or AIM, Hills has taken nutrigenomics from theory to reality. AIM is a three-step process. First, researchers create gene expression profiles of a group of unhealthy pets and a group of healthy pets. Then, by feeding the pets specific targeted ingredients, they're able to shift the unhealthy pet's gene expression to more closely resemble the healthy pet's gene expressions. Finally, researchers use the identified ingredients in the precise proportions to formulate pet foods that support health and wellness. We're utilizing this information to identify the key nutrients or optimize the nutrient balance that's important to develop a diet for both the wellness of an animal or to uh, develop a diet to aid in the nutritional management of a diseased animal, an animal that may have kidney failure or obesity or arthritis. It's just part of Hills Pet Nutrition's dedication to helping our pets live longer, happier lives. Founded more than 60 years ago with a unique commitment to pet health, Hills has never wavered from its mission to enrich and lengthen the special relationship between people and their pets. Hills really understands how special our pets are to us and their unique needs, and they are very committed to providing the best nutrition possible to meet those special needs. The reach of Hills Nutrigenomics research extends beyond the development of its therapeutic and wellness pet foods. Hills contributed to the mapping of the feline genome and shares this important research with the wider veterinary community. I think the opportunity for the pet food companies uh, to take a leadership role in nutrigenomics is really huge, and Hills has certainly been one of the companies that's making great advances there. 
and I think that the research that Hills has been involved with already in the areas of obesity, for example, are already starting to show us the exciting possibilities that are there. Hills Pet Nutrition will continue its groundbreaking research in nutrigenomics to help millions of pets. The future for Hills Pet Nutrition is in large part focused around nutrigenomics from a research perspective. We're really at the earliest stage of understanding of nutrigenomics. We're applying nutrigenomics and we're committed to the continued research and application of nutrigenomics in the development of our nutrition products. It's one more example of Hill's commitment to help pets live longer, healthier lives and enrich and lengthen the special relationship between people and their pets. For more information, visit hillsvet.com.